everyone! Today I just got done with tryouts for Illuminate. Yep, did that. <laughs> so I apologize if I look so, you know, disgusting. <laughs> I just figured I would do my little video for you. Um, it's not going to be anything too long. It's just going to be like an inspirational video to help you guys if you're dealing with the same things I am dealing with. And the topic today is going to be following your dreams. Um, I'm dealing with that every day because I have a big dream and not a lot of people think it's going to happen. This is Boo! Isn't she cute? Say hi to the camera. So cute. She likes to sit up with me, but like she can't because this is my grand my mom and dad's bed and they won't like that. You know? Yeah, so she's gonna be on the floor and it'll be okay. Right? Right! I am Boo. Love me. <laughs> so I would say that the first important thing about following your dreams is finding your dream. <laughs> that's pretty obvious. Yeah, finding a dream and establishing that that's the thing that you want to do. Um, I just kind of, I've always had dreams, but they were never ones that I was like, that's what I'm gonna do. And recently, you know, I decided I wanted to work at Disney, and that's a dream that I'm going to stick with. <laughs> yeah, so I know what my dream is, and now it's just the point of trying to figure out how to get there. The second most important thing is to not let other people's opinions dictate how you feel about that dream. I have so many people that, you know, question what my dream is and, like, if it'll even happen, which I understand that because it's Disney, and, like, who dreams that? Oh, I'm just gonna like dance at Disney. Like, no one dreams that. That's a really random dream. But yeah, no matter what people's opinions think about your dream, because it could be a crazy dream, but as long as you know that's something that you want to do, just stick with it and don't let anyone else's judgments, you know, change how you feel about it. I, I've always known I wanted to dance, you know, somewhere doing something. And so when, like, Disneyland, you know, I thought about that, I thought that was such a great opportunity because. That's like perfect for me. I can smile all the time and I can just dance. For other people, like little, little kids, I just feel in my heart that it's right. And I think that's what's important if you feel that it's right and you can see it happening for yourself, you know, stick with it because it could happen and you just have to believe in it. <laughs> the last thing that I would say is the most important is don't say I can't, say I will because if you keep telling yourself that I can't do this, like it's not going to happen, then it won't happen because no one else is going to believe that for you. So you need to make sure that you stay strong in it and you believe that you can do it and never lose sight of that. I mean, there's going to be so many times that you're like, this is not going to happen, but just stay strong in your dream because if you can see it clearly, then you know that it's something you need to do and that you're going to do whatever you can to get to it. Um, I was looking online for some things like quotes or something and I found this one and it was, it says, if you want to accomplish your dream, you will be able to do so only when you can see it clearly. I think that's really awesome because no one can believe, like I said, no one can believe in your dream and if you don't see that dream being like a real, like something that you could achieve and you don't see it in your view, like that's going to happen for me down the road, then it's not going to happen because I know for me, you know, I mean I would dance anyways even if that wasn't my dream, but I try to do as much dancing as I can, like dance minor and like doing ballet classes and just surround myself in that because that's going to really gear me towards what I want and it's really inspirational for me to see other people dancing and just, you know, all that. Another thing I found was a GPS tells you where you want to go and it provides you with directions. Your dream requires that you create those directions yourself. There is no set path. I think that's really important because it's really true, like, even if someone had the same exact dream as you, their path is different because you can't, there's not like this handbook that's like, if your dream is this, then take these steps and you'll get it. Like, that's not how it works. Everyone is different and sometimes it sucks, but your path is going to be very long. Like mine. I can't even do it until I'm graduated from college, so it's going to be a while. But yes, <laughs> that's all I have for you guys today. Um, it's just something I was thinking about lately with tryouts and everything, and I'm always thinking about it since I'm like needing to think about my future. But I wanted to share some things so that if you're in the same boat as me, you can feel inspired too. So subscribe and like and share and all that grand stuff. 
Um, I am hoping to work on a dance video. It's very nerve-wracking because I think I'm a good dancer, but I don't think I'm the best, and so it's kind of crazy putting a video of me dancing online when there's so many other good ones. But yeah, I am working on it. <laughs> so, I hope you feel inspired, and if there's anything you guys want to know about, like how I feel about something, just leave it in the comments down below. Okay. Bye. Baby, we were born.